are the siblings? Who's the brothers and sisters in this picture? Okay, easy number one. They got the same lunch. They got the same mama. All right, what about these? Who are the siblings? Can you see? Different dress, same mom. All right, here, who are the siblings playing in the playground? This one's tough, this one's tough. Matching bucket and spade. All right, who are the siblings? Bobbing up, bobbing down. Twins. Guys, it's the last one. Who are the siblings? Your last chance to guess it right. Write to us in the comments and tell us who are the siblings. Adam called his insurance company one day. He called his agent there and he said somebody robbed my house. Look at that thief. Somebody robbed his house, so the agent soon came over, but he brought with him a detective. They broke the window, he said. And they carried away several expensive paintings. Hmm, I haven't even cleaned the glass up yet. I have to look around your house, said the detective. Of, of course, he says. Here is my bedroom. Nice bedroom. This is my office. And here is the guest bedroom. Ooh, nice photo. I suppose you stole the paintings yourself, he said, to request compensation. Ooh, busted. Why did he think so? What did the detective see in the three rooms? Look at the office. I noticed a photo of it in this room. What did he notice? <gasps> the pool table used to stand right by the window, but you moved it. Now it's against the wall. You moved it aside before breaking the window so as not to damage the cloth. Finally, it's impossible to play pool now. Check it out, it's right by the wall. Who is more stupid? The girl with the dog or the guy with the monkeys? A bunch of monkeys can be very dangerous, especially if they're hungry. Okay, who is more stupid? On the phone. Captain Credit Card? Or Princess Cash over here? I hope you know the answer to this, guys. Never send anyone your CVV code. All right, who is more stupid? Mr. iPod or emo girl walking on the tracks? Check it out guys, it's a red light for the cars and that train doesn't have a chance to stop. The police arrived on call to the bank. Which had been robbed today? All right, Captain Cop, let's do this. The teller said he was wearing a mask, so I didn't see his face. Look at that huge nose. But he left dirty footprints on the floor. That's strange, said the cop. It's dry and sunny today. Hmm. Unfortunately, the marks are indistinct. They can't make out the shoe size or anything like that. Later, the police identified three suspects. Adam with a massive chin, Jack, and Nick. Adam says, I was sleeping at home after work. Hmm, maybe. Jack says, I was cleaning my house. If that was me, they'd know I was lying. 
And Nick says, I was at home watching TV. So... Which of them is the robber? Which of them could have made that muddy, muddy footprint? Answer, Jack could have left the muddy footprints because, check it out, to get into the bank, he had to go through the park, which was muddy. Little Annie got lost in a shopping mall one day. <gasps> Soon she was found by a very, very tall and nice guard. Annie was too young to talk. So she couldn't tell him where her parents were. Luckily the guard was super smart. He brought the girl to the security room and started looking for her parents. All right, let's check out the cameras. Who are her parents? Okay, let's check out this scene. Or number two. With the baguettes. Or is it number three? Who are her parents? Check out Mr. Baguette Dad. Got a matching bow. Found the parents everyone safe. Which mom is more stupid? Oh, we all know our moms can be stupid sometimes. Hope my mom's not listening. It's the chilies that's way too hot for a baby. All right, number two, which mom is more stupid? This baby's already on fire, guys. Okay, number three. Which mom is more stupid? The one on the right. This girl, she is not gonna drown with armbands. Still pretty stupid mom, though. All right, guys, which mom is more stupid? Write to us in the comments, and don't tell your mom. Hope's parents went to the mall, hopefully to buy her a present. They left her all alone in the house. She was watching her favorite TV show, when suddenly she heard someone trying to open the door. Hope came up to the door, got up on the stool, and looked through the peephole. There was a huge bearded man behind it with a creepy smile. Hope rushed to the living room to think about what she could do to save her life. I mean, she is freaking out. Number one, she can hide in the apartment. She can call her parents or she can call 911. What should she do first? Nobody will know about the danger, and no one will come to help her. A call will take at least five minutes. It's way too long. Number two, this call will take a few seconds. Hope's parents will better be able to do something to help her. While Hope is hiding and calling 911. Oof. You are awoken at 3 a.m. by a knock on your door. Scared? You shouldn't be. It's your parents. They're calling to let you know they are coming over for breakfast. A what? You're confused, but you quickly think of what food you have. Okay, what are you gonna make for mom? You have some bread, jam, butter, milk, and luckily some coffee. What do you open first?
she open the coffee because they need to make the coffee or maybe she open the jam or the milk maybe the milk's too cold and the bread and the butter and the no open the door for your parents a man is driving on a rainy stormy night suddenly he sees three people waiting at the bus stop there's his longtime friend who once saved his life who kind of owes him one then there's an old woman who looks like she's about to die and number three is the woman of his dreams he only has one available seat what should he do guys i'm telling you if you get this one right you are a genius And obviously, I didn't get it right the first time I saw it. Here's the genius plan. Are you ready? You ask your friend to take the old woman to the hospital. And... You enjoy your time with the woman of your dreams. Nice. Who is more stupid? The mom in the sauna with a baby? Or the man about to chuck a baby into the ocean? A or B, guys? The worst parent award of the year goes to boiling a baby or drowning a baby. So we know they're both pretty stupid. But write to us in the comments, tell us who you think is more stupid.